This video is for any patient who has had an orthopedic surgery, specifically a joint replacement, and is suffering from significant postoperative swelling. This video looks at patients who do not have known lymphedema, but you have that persistent, thick, painful swelling long after surgery has been completed. Swelling is one of the most common and significant complaints that patients have following joint replacement surgery. And many patients suffer from this prolonged swelling, which can lead to pain, range of motion issues, and potentially other functional deficits as well. There are actually quite a few studies that look at how traditional lymphedema therapy can help these patients. One study performed by Dr. Chihan and team from 2021 looked at 21 patients who completed total knee replacement surgeries. Now, both treatment groups received traditional physical therapy, but one group had manual lymphatic drainage in the first three post-operative days. At day three, and also six weeks later, there were significant improvements in pain levels, quality of life measures, as well as kinesiophobia, or the fear of movement. This is a really important factor to consider during rehabilitation because the ability to move without pain or fear is truly essential for quality rehab, and it provides greater patient satisfaction. I mentioned this study first because as a physical therapist, as well as a CLT, I really do believe in the power of pain management and pain reduction when you're considering post-operative rehabilitation. MLD feels good. A different study by Dr. Ebert and colleagues published back in 2013 looked at manual lymphatic drainage on post-op days two, three, and four, again following a total knee replacement. Both groups received traditional physical therapy as well. But with the addition of MLD, it was found that active knee flexion was improved for up to six weeks following surgery. Other studies also showed improvement in early range of motion results without a significant change in gait or walking, but there was also a decreased prevalence of contractures of the knee or prolonged tightening and range of motion issues. In 2017, there was a study called the STIX study that looked at short stretch bandaging for the first 24 hours following a knee replacement. There were 50 patients involved and it showed that compression bandaging was safe. There was no significant improvements in pain, complications from surgery or range of motion though. But it suggested that larger studies should be done and short stretch bandaging is what we use traditionally in lymphedema therapy. So I'm just excited that these things are really being looked at. Other research reviews looked at swelling following orthopedic surgeries, including joint replacements. And it also concluded that manual lymphatic drainage and manual edema mobilization specific to post-operative procedures should be included in physical therapy treatment protocols. Other injuries that were included in these reviews included ankle injuries, as well as distal radius fractures or forearm fractures. And it also included bandaging using short stretch bandages and long stretch bandages. The impactful statement from this review is, after elective surgeries, when the significant edema appears or persists beyond recovery time, complete decongestive therapy and manual edema mobilization should be recommended in addition to conventional physical therapy. So all of these studies show the benefits of adding MLD to post-operative rehabilitation in patients who undergo these surgeries that traditionally do cause significant swelling. I'll add on a personal note that I have seen MLD, manual lymphatic drainage, and very appropriate compression garments that are specific to post-operative rehab have a positive effect on our parasympathetic nervous system. Our rest and digest and healing process is promoted because we know also that prolonged stress responses following surgery can delay recovery, prolong inflammation, and make rehab harder and more complicated. So I think if anyone is suffering from prolonged, thick swelling from a surgery and you are not a lymphedema patient, it is still beneficial to add manual lymphatic drainage and compression to effectively progress the rehab process. I will continue to utilize manual lymphatic drainage in traditional post-operative rehabilitation protocols. So anyone who is suffering from prolonged swelling following an injury 
or a surgery, should speak with your surgeon and your entire medical team to make sure that a certified lymphedema therapist is included in the rehabilitation process. My name is Lisa Berman Silvestri. I'm a physical therapist and a certified lymphedema therapist, and my goal is to make us all lymph smart.